Minority voters and the midterm elections, rising crime and record-breaking food and gas prices have black and Hispanic voters shifting increasingly to the Republican Party. Republican California congressional candidate Joe Collins joining us live from L.A. Joe, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. So black and Hispanic voters have been loyal to the Democratic Party for decades now. Uh, in your eyes, why are so many minority voters now switching to the Republican Party? Well, one of the biggest reasons why a lot of minority voters are switching to the Republican Party is because the current condition of the communities that we live in. I'm from South Central Los Angeles, and it's been crime and poverty since I was a child. I'm 36 years old right now, and we're looking for something different. We want businesses, we want great education, we want opportunities, and we want our neighborhoods cleaned up. Democrats have yet been able to provide that, and so now it's time for us to, to switch parties. And a lot of people say that they are struggling, of course, to pay for gas and food, that they are postponing vacations, they're eating out less. Uh, in your mind, does any issue in the midterms matter as much as inflation and how it's just pummeling people's wallets every single day? Well, every single issue matters. I mean, everything attacks the pocketbook these days, the high gas prices uh, due to the failed policies of the Biden administration, uh, the cost of living, the cost of food, the, the cost of of taxes when you have a business, the smash and grabs, the, the homelessness, all of these attack the pocketbooks. And I think people want to, to have a, a better idea of what their American uh, dream is. And right now, they're not being able to live it. Well, the midterm's just 10 days away now. Uh, what do you think is the most important issue uh, for voters to keep in mind as they are casting their ballots? <laughs> well, we're in California, so that uh, what was most important is hard to decide for the voters. But I can tell you this, people who used to be rich are now struggling just like people who are in the middle and lower class. So I think one thing that people are galvanizing around is the fact that we need to do something to increase uh, our quality of life and decrease the cost of living. The cost of living is so bad. Uh, the majority of homeless people that are on the streets right now are not mentally ill. These are people who literally cannot afford apartments. They can't afford housing. And the state of California and, and the current administration is doing absolutely nothing to, to help these people. I absolutely hear you, hear you, Joe Collins. Thank you so much for your time tonight. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.